I'm Abel. Welcome to Vox Angelica. Headlines Rainbow colored fairy fish species discovered. The insect brain decoded. Hyderabad to host India's largest data center. Biodegradable nanoparticle by IIT Kanpur. Two Kerala scientists bring laurels to state. Palakkad in history reminders. World number one Ashley Barty retires. Euro champions fail to qualify for FIFA World Cup. Raphaelite excelled in Muatha. Scientists in the Maldives have formally described a new species of rainbow colored fish named the Rose Whale Fairy Wrasse. It can live 160 to 500 feet beneath the ocean surface in the twilight zone in the deep waters of Maldives. It is the first new species to be named by a Maldivian researcher and have its name derived from Divehi, the national language of Maldives. With its beautiful hues, the fish already was being exploited through the aquarium hobby trade even before it was named as a species. Researchers at IIT Kanpur have created a biodegradable nanoparticle that can be used as an alternative to chemical-based insecticides to protect crops from bacterial and fungal illness. These nanoparticles would reduce the risk of crop infection while also increasing agricultural productivity and helps to improve farming as a whole. Researchers were found interested in understanding insects for their superior navigation skills to humans. Developments in microscopy and genetics enabled scientists to make different brain cells emit different colors of light, which allowed researchers to distinguish individual neurons and how they connect to each other in the brain. Scientists tested out the memory of insects by capturing and cooling them down to melting ice temperature for 30 minutes. Both the direction and distance traveled by the insects are encoded by neurons in its brain as it travels away from its nest. But how is this stored in their memory is a mystery which is yet to be discovered. Microsoft has announced to set up its fourth data center in Hyderabad, which will be one of the largest data centers in India that will be operational by 2025. Microsoft already has data centers in three Indian regions across Pune, Mumbai and Chennai. And this addition will meet the growing demands for Microsoft Cloud services from both the private enterprises as well as the government sector. 47 cannon cells were discovered from the Palakkad Fort in Kerala while excavating for a pipeline as a part of repair work on the century-old fort under the Archaeological Survey of India. The Palakkad Fort, which was recaptured and rebuilt royally by Hyder Ali in 1766 AD, remains as one of the best preserved forts in the state of Kerala. According to a preliminary study, these shells were stored by the army of Tipu Sultan, son of Hyder Ali, while they were fighting the British. However, the age of the shells is yet to be determined to get a clearer picture of the ruler. In recognition for the outstanding contribution in science and technology, two scientists from the Indian Institute of Space, Science and Technology have been awarded the Kerala State Young Scientist Award. Assistant Professor at IIST Damya AM received the award for developing algorithms and methods for the extraction of information from data collected using LIDAR technology. This is used in streams such as disaster management, forest biomass estimation, roadway alignment and elevation model creation. Associate Professor at IIST Anup CS has been awarded in recognition of two of his work, developing high performing circuit for different types of sensors with a wide span of operation and remote measurement capabilities as well as developing an electronic system for current output sensors. World number one Ashley Barty has shocked the sporting world by announcing a retirement from professional tennis at just 25. The Australian tennis star dropped the bombshell weeks after becoming the first homegrown Australian Open champion in 44 years, joining tennis most exclusive club with a Grand Slam crown on three different surfaces. I'm absolutely spent and physically have nothing more to give, was our retirement state. Euro 2020 champions Italy failed to qualify for FIFA World Cup after a stunning 1-0 loss to the Minos, North Macedonia in their World Cup qualifying match. This is the second consecutive World Cup in which Italy failed to qualify for the finals. Macedonia will face Portugal to ensure their spot in the final. Rishikesh, class 6 student of SRCS, bagged first position in the 7th Kerala State 
under 23 and senior Motai Championship 22 conducted by Kerala State Motai Association. He has been undergoing training in this martial art for the past 7 years. That's all for this week. Stay tuned.